Well hi guys, it's George from Cyprus Insight and today I'm in Brodara and I'm going down towards the beach I'm going to have a little coastal walk and see what's going on down here I'm going to the Sunrise Jade They're... Oh look at this sea flat calm today or oh, reasonably calm now I went down to the sailing club the other day guys and the sea was a little bit rough, no wind. Shame, could have gone sailing, eh guys? So down to our famous coastal path. As I say, we're starting here at the Pearl, the Sunrise Pearl. There's our lovely kiosk where we get our corn on the cob. As we're passing here midday, we always like to have corn on the cob, especially from our corner kiosk. Look out for the video, guys. Oh, I wonder what these people are doing. Looks like they're fixing the veranda areas. Putting some lights in, perhaps, guys. Looks like some trunking going in for some wires. What a beautiful day it is. Look at this. Now there are lots of people enjoying the beach today. Now you can see them just ahead of us. I think it's about 20 odd degrees today. Could go up a little bit. Yeah, could be a little bit higher than 20 degrees. There, someone going in the sea, braving the cold sea and it's not freezing cold guys it is fairly cold but not freezing so this is the sunrise beach hotel and i'm going to show you how they're getting on with the swimming pool they're doing an amazing job oh, lovely flowers i haven't got flowers yet in my garden like this i've got the actual ground cover plant but I haven't flowered yet. Oh, never mind. So let's have a look around. Oh, wow. So all the floor's done and it looking amazing. Look at this lovely swimming pool now. And they've done the surround of the swimming pool. So let's carry on through, guys. See what's going on. lovely new pool area around here guys at this hotel got lots of people enjoying the beach well, what's he got on he's got unusual swimming trunks on isn't he guys oh look at that he's showing us some muscles He's put his swimming trunks down. It looks like he's got a nappy on, but it's not. It's uh, swimming trunks. Right, let's go down. Down the coastal path. Oh, isn't it lovely and quiet down here, guys? Actually, this is an opportunity to thank our subscribers. About 13,000. Wow. Thank you, each and every one of you. And of course, this time of the year, we get lots and lots of new viewers. Don't forget to subscribe. It's completely free. And our new viewers are possibly looking around, see where they can stay. And each and every one of these hotels has got its own individual video. And of course the restaurants have as well. When we go out for a meal guys, we do a little video. Show you what it's like, see what the food is like, see if it's delish. 
how much it costs and you can look up the restaurants around the area that you're going to stay see what you fancy to eat there's the water sports guys oh look they're putting a new platform in excellent or jetty should i say so we've got a brand new jetty going up for the water sports and i think they had a brand new platform here hi guys we're having a brand new jetty to this year it looks really good whatever you're doing fantastic let's go up the slope i do like this slope well we've got some walkers and we are enjoying our coastal path up we go oh hickety pickety bench Now we're heading to Fig Tree Bay, the lovely Fig Tree Bay. I bet there's a lot of people on the beach there. Another favourite throughout the year. Of course, a lot of the hotels are shut at the moment, guys. Constantino the Great, that's open all year round. It's February, or the end of February, should I say. 22 degrees out of season lovely and quiet and of course you can get the buses that'll take you into the villages and the towns so if you're coming out of season guys you do get this marvellous weather but it's not guaranteed last week do believe we had about three or four days of overcast and rain. And I think January and February are the dodgy months to come over. And then the rest of the year, not too bad at all. But as I said, out of season, you're risking it a bit. I like Constantino the Great. We went and did a video there a few weeks ago and we went into the indoor spa area. We've got a heated indoor pool and it was gorgeous. It was so warm in there. So of course, if you don't fancy swimming in the cold swimming pools and the swimming pools are cold this time of the year, a bit too cold to swim in. The sea is not too bad. But if you've got the option of using one of those heated swimming pools in the spa area, well, guys, you've got the best of both worlds, haven't you? Lovely, quiet beaches, beautiful weather, not too hot, so you can go out exploring. Excellent. Right, we're coming into the Fig Tree Bay area and we've got that marvellous island. Look at that. Lovely little island you can swim out to. Do a bit of snorkelling around that island. I have seen a few people on the island, but I think it's a little bit difficult to get on the island itself. A little bit rocky around the island. Maybe if you've got your rock shoes on or beach shoes and go out swimming with them and when you get there you might be able to climb over the rocks and get on the island. There, there's the water sports people. Yeah, I thought there might be lots of people on the beach guys. There certainly is. Not as many as I thought actually. There's one, two, three four five six seven eight some down here nine ten ten groups of people on the beach doing a bit of sunbathing in fact looks like we've got uh, dad and young child going into the sea I think he's uh, backed out the young ones backed out 
come on dad encourage him in as I said it can be a little bit chilly but once you're in it's beautiful so refreshing I do like to see this time of the year and that's why I was a bit disappointed yesterday I didn't go out sailing so I could have got in the sea and then uh, had a little swim and then I could have gone out and had a, a little sail around and videoed it for you guys now I have been repairing two older boats that I acquired last year and I will do a little video because I've invented a couple of little bits and pieces make it easier to sell so I want to show you guys what it's like and the little bits and pieces that I've made up if anyone's into sailing oh look they've varnished all the handrails look spectacular and I did see them down in the main strip down there varnishing all the bus stops just sprucing up everything really making it nice right here we are fig tree bay itself right Isabella we've bumped into a couple of fluffy cats haven't we you're, you're very fluffy oh you're pretty we'll just let them have some food there you go right let's carry on through thank you very much Henrik for the super thanks much appreciated right we've got the car park area here on the right there we are we can see the gardeners there doing all the public areas just beyond the car park and of course a free car park there and then we've got this viewing platform this was put up quite a few years ago nice idea actually they didn't put it up for us guys they just put it up for general public if anyone's wondering there we go right to the end and then we can see fig tree bay on our left and beyond there we are see oh it's a bit bouncy isn't it oh, i like bouncing bounce 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 remember that song i think it hit the charts definitely did it hit number one i can't remember anyway hey there's the dad and child going in this sea oh someone's just come out of the sea there we are i think they're gonna do it eventually so guys angie's been unwell unfortunately and dave and us would like to wish you a speedy recovery get well soon angie oh there's a ship out there look at that right we're going in that direction aren't we let's go oh that's really bouncy oh, i like bouncing bounce 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 and then it just went bounce 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 in it can't remember now you remember guys now we're going to go over this massive glass floor yeah and you can see some amazing archaeological finds just beyond the glass there just walking over it amazing brilliant another viewing platform that one don't stick out that's just on the rocks so that won't bounce so now we're going past the king jason hotel oh, gorgeous hotel i like these sort of uh, round beds they have and they've got cushions on them in the uh, summer i think they're going to varnish them they're lovely hardwood but i think they're going to need a little varnishing this year it's probably why they've put them out here tidy them up a little bit and there's a slope i do like their slope and that's adults only guys and they've got this amazing swimming pool on the right where you can do exercise and they've got a jacuzzi there as well now that's a big fluffy cat look at that come on want some hmm. Hmm. i'm not sure you're not sure. Come on in. Right. Let's not frighten it. Let's go round. Or well, some of them do get frightened. 
so we'll go around. There's the Norsica Blue Beach Hotel, or the Norsica Blue Beach Hotel, and they've got a platform to get into the sea. There's a the platform, and at the end of the platform, they do put some steps down. They take them away in the winter. Now guys, don't go to any of these platforms and dive off, it is dangerous. They do put steps down, as I say, in the summer. They are cordoned off anyway. So that's the Norsica guys, lovely hotel. I call it a village actually. And we've been in there, they've got some refurbishment going on. I do believe it's uh, the restaurants having some new restaurants in there and we've done a little video we have been in there have a look around see what's going on there can you see it's got those beautiful blue doors and windows okay there we are there's another platform we can get onto again don't go down there and in the winter jump off that one's not been called and off well it was once but the tape's gone oh hickety pickety convenient located bench with an amazing view and you'll find that all the benches are put in locations where you get amazing views oh what are they doing over there then in the Norsica Blue. Oh, you see, inside, guys, he's doing some work inside. Here we are, giving the place a tidy up. Oh, the local council's down at the end. Probably gardeners again. Right now, we're right on the new coastal path. Look at this one. You've got lovely stones or paving slabs, all different sizes, aren't they? Oh, let me point out this lovely little miniature beach. Look at that. Definitely Steve's beach, is it? Yeah, Steve will like this, our friend. He likes miniature little beaches. It's stones getting into the sea, guys. A gentle slope, but it is stony. And look how sheltered it is, all the way around here. Beautiful beach. Yeah, I think he's tidying up that uh, swimming pool, guys. Right, so there's a local council truck. Ah, it's got strimmers at the back of the truck, so yeah, they are gardeners. Thought they might have been. Now, as I said, this is a brand new coastal path. Only a few years old. So these are the conifers that guys all planted down here in memory of young students who have passed away. There's the sign. And they were planted in May 2022. Here we are. And some people have got their own individual conifer. You can see the names down there. Yeah, oh, there's another one here, you see. Yeah. There we are. Lovely conifers. I bet they're going to be gorgeous in three or four years' time when they're really big. See this one, guys? There we are. There's the name down there. Okay, so let's carry on round. More conifers left and right. I'm not sure what this place is for. It does look like a wedding venue actually. We're not 100% sure. There's no reason why they would put that otherwise. Parties or venues now we've got a brand new coastal path going straight up that's that hardwood that we saw last year 
or we've got the other coastal path going towards the right. Which one do you want to take? Hardwood one, the proper boardwalk. Now we saw this beautiful hardwood, as I said last year, all stacked up on the right hand side. And this was just mud. We see it going in. I said, that's amazing hardwood. It's about two inches thick, guys. Must have cost an absolute fortune. And the beams underneath, they are solid hardwood as well. And they are about six inches thick. And it goes on and on. And they've done a beautiful job of it. Look how straight those rivets are. Yeah. And then on the side we've got the concrete with these fancy new lights. Of course more of these conifers. There, can you see the lovely lights? There, the path over there goes along next to these lovely amazing villas so you can cut across oh conveniently located benches coming up can you remember the pathway here just all rocky hickety pickety and rocks juddering out everywhere by the way guys, it's another word for our channel, juddering out, it means poking out here and there, but we call it juddering out. Oh, there's a pleasure speedboat coming up. That might have come from the brand new Aya Napa Marina. We've done lots of videos down there, it really is posh guys. You wanna get down there. We had a hamburger, didn't we? when it first opened there was a couple of restaurants open one of them a hamburger place and it was delish right that's where we're heading guys the sunrise jade hotel we're doing some refurbishments and we're going to have a look around see what's going on anyway let's carry on down oh there's a brand new conveniently located benches they are gorgeous aren't they aren't they lovely wow ergonomic. Yeah, they are ergonomic 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 let's try if they're ergonomic oh they are ergonomic oh I don't know I fancy a little bit more back right there's the lovely view as I say I think I'm falling asleep. Yes, I am. Oh dear. Right, let's carry on down, shall we? But guys, so uh, not too far walk by the looks of it. Right, let's carry on through. See what else we can discover. Now, as I said, they've got these luxury houses here. And we suspect no beach. Oh, there they are. No beach. We're getting good at this. So if there's rocks, guys, you'll find sea view luxury villas. And if there's actual beach, you'll find there'll be a hotel around the beach. Oh, what's this coming up? It's all brand new. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, I wonder why they had to cut this one in half. Probably couldn't get long, wide enough planks. Yeah, I remember coming down here, guys. It was JCBZ. I think we were jumping up and down and going in some of the cavey bits and the bits that were a bit hickety pickety. And we've got a curly whirly conveniently located bench and shade. And it's all brand new. Right, 
Ooh, let's go this way. Oh, we're leaving the hardwood boardwalk. And now we're coming across this lovely pebble path. Oh, what is this? Another new area. Is this a viewing platform? Looks like it. Oh, another brand new viewing platform. Very similar to the one at Fig Tree Bay. Does it stick out beyond the rocks? Oh, yes, it does. Just about. Oh, look, guys. There was a path going down to the rocky area here but they've blocked it off it is a bit dangerous a very hickety pickety look got bits of stone and bits of concrete everywhere so they've blocked that off guys more car parking areas oh more cats excellent there we are. What we've got? It's got quite a few fluffy cats. Oh, little ginger cat. They all look healthy, don't they? Right round the corner. Ah, some new steps. Let's go and have a look at these, shall we? There we are. Down we go. Oh yes, I can remember these being a little bit uh, broken. Oh wow, look at this. Brand new steps going down to a platform where there's stainless steel and wooden steps straight into the water. So there's no beach here, guys. There's the old steps down there on the left. You can barely make them out beyond the bushes. But we've got these brand new steps now with handrails and everything. Very safe. Great place to snorkel. Ah, there's the beach down there. That's a lovely beach, isn't it? Look at that. Those houses have got amazing lawn. Looks like they've got a shared lawn, isn't it? Just down here. I was saying to the viewers, it's about 20 degrees, but it feels a lot more than that, doesn't it? I think it's about 25 degrees today. It's, uh, I've got my t-shirt and shorts on, and I'm quite hot. Not sweaty though, not too sweaty tiny breeze we're passing the Coralie Spa Hotel guys that's here on the right and we're coming up to the Sunrise Jade there we are we're at the Sunrise Jade guys there's a cat here do you want to give the cat a little bit of food before we go on to the Sunrise Jade, see what's going on in there. Looks like there's a container outside, so maybe a bit of work going on in the Sunrise Jade. Here we are, fluffy cat. We've come across a lot of fluffy cats this year. Their winter coat. It is their winter coat, that's right. Right, and you can see that there's a little nick out of the, his ear or her ear and that means it's been neutered been taken to the vet and neutered and looked after right let's go up to the sunrise jade mm, I can see some sort of forklift that's all cordoned off I can see white van, pickup truck thing. So there's a Coralie Spa residence, guys. Oh look, there's two apartments for sale now, right next to the pool, look. 7777-5656. There we are. 
Right, what is it? This is a forklift, isn't it? That's all cordoned off. We've even got uh, some signs up for architects and what have you. Oh, there's a skip because there's not a lot going on here. Oh, it's a little quarters for the workers. Oh, some paving slabs. Look, can you see there's some paving slabs here? Can you see anything in the hotel? Oh, one minute you can. Lots of scaffolding. Fancy missing that, eh? So there was nothing else going on. There's great big scaffolding at the back. Well, what do you think's going on? We've got insulation and we've got tons of scaffolding. It, ooh, don't know. I was going to say perhaps they're painting the place. We'll go around the other side. Have a look. There's a skip. What's in the skip? Hmm, not a lot in the skip. That doesn't give us a clue. Go round, shall we? See if we can spot something going on. Now oh, we've got private houses here at the back. There's a walkway. Ah, there we are. There. Can you see? I do believe that's extra floors have gone up. There, can you see that guys? And it looks like they're virtually finished. There we are. And then we've got, um, unless that's not an extra floor, guys, and they've just uh, rendered the outside of the building and they're painting it. Let me see if I can spot the patio doors. Well, the doors look like they're the same doors as downstairs and they're refurbishing up the top so there are either refurbished rooms right at the top guys or it's a brand new floor and it looks like it's virtually finished it's all rendered and it looks like uh, the painters have got come in so there you are so there it is guys the sunrise jade we're going to finish this video here but we will be starting another video and we're going to walk to the main strip so look out for the video guys and we will time it and see how long it takes from the Sunrise Jade to go to the main strip. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's somewhere you'd like me to go, put it in the comments below.